I think sometimes people in rural areas do feel very isolated, not just geographically. Um, and I think certainly older people sometimes find it uh, more difficult to come forward to, to, to get help for things as well. I think loneliness is something that you know a lot of us can be at different stages of our life and that can be um, triggered by a crisis. Um, you don't necessarily have to be socially isolated to be lonely, you can be surrounded by lots of people. They may even live within a family but they, they still feel quite lonely and they want to be connected perhaps to other people of their age as well and to meet and, and to share mutual ideas and mutual interests. A lot of people may be lonely and may exhibit signs of being lonely, either emotionally or physically, um, but they may not necessarily be ready to admit they are. As village agents, um, we can have those conversations. You know, we can get to know someone and those conversations may be, what, what did you do, you know, when, when you were working, if you were working, what are your hobbies? You know, maybe looking around the room and, you know, commenting on, you know, photos or paintings or something. And then, you know, getting into a bit more of a deeper conversation and sort of finding out, you know, what it is they like doing. I think it's very difficult sometimes because it's putting people outside their comfort zone very often. They don't particularly want to do it, it's outside their routine. However, um, for some people they can go many days without seeing somebody and so once they actually do make that effort to go out, um, it, it may be that what they go to isn't the right thing for them but they've quite enjoyed the whole experience of going out. So they may not want to try that again but I quite like going out, I'd like to try some other activity. So Rural Connections um, is a new project um, in North Somerset, um, delivered by the village agents of Wern, West of England Rural Network, um, and we are delivering this because we've got some funding from the National Lottery Community Fund. Um, and it's important that this project is known that it's community-led, so we're reaching out to the community to make sure that um, they get involved, they tell us exactly what they would like to see in their village, new groups, um, and we're here to um, help and facilitate. Yeah.